What's up? Danny Hayasaki with Colin Inc. helping people do their business better. Today, we're going to take a look at the Jabra Speak 510. Why I haven't done a video on this, I don't know. But this thing is one of Jabra's top selling USB speakerphone uh, for a reason. It just works. So let's get into all features and functions that are available on the Speak 510 before we get into actually testing to see how well this thing sounds. Let's get right into it. First of all, there are four primary models, 7510-109, the 7510-209, the 7510-309, and the 7510-409. The 510 speakerphone, basically, just the, the puck. And then you're going to have the 510 plus models that include that little dongle. And you see, I'm holding the case to show you that A, it includes a case with inside pocket there so that you can store the dongle so you don't lose it because it's, it's a tiny little guy. Speak 510 by itself without the dongle you're looking at $149 and with the dongle you're looking at $179. Of course this is MSRP. You can get with your authorized Java partner and you know work out whatever. They are only available in USB-A in terms of the uh, connectivity. They do come in UC and Microsoft versions but it's not the Microsoft Teams version so you're not going to have a dedicated Microsoft Teams button on the Speak 510 but it will work in Microsoft environments. These do not support full duplex or don't have full duplex. Omnidirectional microphones, uh, if you are using it wirelessly with the dongle, you have up to 15 hours of talk time, which is fantastic. Your mic pickup range is 1.5 meters or 4.9 feet, which of course we'll test in here. Uh, the Bluetooth version 3.0, so that is a smart button and when you get it, it's off. But if you activate it, you'll have the ability to access or to make it like a speed dial button or to use it with your voice assistants like Siri, Google Assistant, MS Cortana. I'll show you that in the Java Direct software. This is a personal to small group speakerphone. It's not designed to support 50 people in a massive conference room. If you need devices to support larger spaces, reach out to us, we can help you. But anyway, let's get this guy plugged in and I'll show you what that looks like. All right, stay tuned. Here we have the Java Direct software, the user interface here. And so you'll see I have the Jabra Speak 510 USB plugged in. And this is a great little side-by-side -side picture. So you see that the Speak 750 that I have happens to be the Microsoft Teams certified version. So it does have the dedicated uh, Microsoft Teams button. So here we are, here's the device. Speak 510. So if I go looking for it on my mobile device, it's going to say literally Danny's, you know, Jabra Speak 510. Here is the button configuration. So that smart button, that little sort of triangle button, you have the ability to make it a speed dial button or a voice assistant uh, with smartphone button. Uh, for right now, I'm just going to leave it at no function. Uh, and then here's the product information. And so now let's get these guys plugged in and get them tested. All right. So I'm back. So right now we have the Jabra Speak 510 connected via USB cable. Let's say if I was facing it, right? So one, two, three, test one, two, three, the Jabra Speak uh, 510. But I'm going to get up and I'm going to move. I'm going to back up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So back here from there is probably 10 feet from where that Speak 510 is located. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Turn around. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, so now I want to, what I want to do is I'm going to actually play some music. And I haven't picked any music yet, so I'm going to pick some something. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and play it through that speaker. And then I'll also see how loud uh, we can make it get. And I have my little handy dandy decibel reader there so you guys can see how loud uh, this speakerphone uh, can be. All right. All right, so we're back. I got it paired to my mobile device, and I'm going to use some of this uh, no copyright sounds. Let's play a little bit. So what I've noticed is I can't control the volume up down from my actual uh, mobile device. So you have to control it from here. All right, so that's the max volume that you're going to get. So it looks like it gets up to around 87 decibels, and we all know from the 47 decibels is about the 
average uh, noise uh, level for uh, standard office. Anything above 85 is going to start damaging your ears. But anyway, let's uh, plug this guy via the USB dongle and see if the mic pickup uh, audio quality is the same. Recorded and then at the end, two side by side so you can hear what it's like when it's recorded and what it's like the USB dongle to see if it makes a difference. There may not be any difference. I don't know. That's why we do these things. Stay tuned. All right, so here we are. We're back. Now we have the Jabra Speak 510 paired via the Link 370 USB dongle. Uh, test, test, one, two. Test, test, one, two. You know, I'm standing from it. I'm pretty close to it. It's probably like, I don't know, two, three feet from here, a little longer than that. Uh, but anyway, test, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Turning my back to it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. But anyway, so there we are. So right now we have the Jabra Speak 510 connected via USB cable. Now we have the Jabra Speak 510 paired via the Link 370 USB dongle. But this is it. If you have any questions about this particular product or any of the Jabra solutions, feel free to reach out to us. All our contact information is going to be in the description box below. Tell us what you think about the Speak 510. Do you have one? Do you use it? What do you think about it? Uh, put it in the, in the comments below. Uh, I do read every single one of them, uh, and so sometimes it does take me a little bit to answer. If you like this type of video, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment below, let us know what you'd like to see, and we'll do our best to make it. Thanks.